On this Bytes Review, I teach you how to build, upgrade, and fix PCs. But not everybody is able to do that, and not everybody has the time. And well, maybe not everybody wants to spend $4,000. You want to spend just enough so that you can get the perfect PC that can do anything in your price range. In this video, we're going to be doing an unboxing and an overview of the Geekom AX8 Pro, an AI-ready all-arounder PC that can do anything you need it to. So let's check it out. All right, again, the Geekom AX8 Pro. So this bad boy is running on the new Zen 4 8 core 16 thread Ryzen 9 8945 HS CPU up to four gigahertz in this little teeny tiny box with 16 megs of L3 cache. Wow, <laughs> this thing is seriously tiny and I'll get back to this in once. I'm, I'm really impressed by that. So actually, I'll get back to this in one second. All right. And then here we can see the green mini PC global leader, Geekom. Really nice presentation here. And then here, dear customer, thank you for purchasing our product. And then just some instructions on what everything is on this build. This machine itself has an AMD RDNA 3 architecture iGPU, a Radeon 780M with 12 CUs, and it can be boosted up to 2,800 megahertz with variable refresh rate shading and ray tracing. It even can power four 4K monitors in this little teeny tiny package. Oh, wow. Okay, it has a drawer. All right. Wow, I'm really impressed by this. So this is so tiny that this little stand here, you can attach it to the bottom of the PC. Then you can attach it to the back of your monitor. So basically it looks like you don't have a PC. That's nice. Then here we have the power brick to plug into the unit and then plug this into here and into the wall. It comes with an HDMI cable and it is about three feet long. The unit itself is aluminum so that itself will help cool down the PC. You can see openings over here. And along the bottom, serial number, UPC, all that good stuff down here. Rubber feet so that it won't move around when it's on a desk. And two USB 3.0s and HD audio and the power button. Now along the back here, we have two HDMI ports one USB 3.2 type A, 10 gigabit per second, which is these as well. So three in total, then one USB 2.0, then one USB 3.2 Gen 2 type C, 10 gigabit per second, along with a 40 gigabit per second USB type C port with a 2.5 gigabit per second ethernet jack and DC ports right over here. Now you can't see it from here, but this does also have Wi-Fi 6E and Bluetooth 5.2. It also comes pre-installed with Windows 11 Pro. It has a nice aluminum feeling shell that feels incredibly cool to the touch, which will act as a heatsink as well. So let's go ahead and plug this in real quick. To plug it in, we have a bunch of options over here. For my mouse, we'll do USB 2.0. And for the keyboard, we'll do USB 3.0. And then for video, we'll do HDMI, Ethernet. We'll plug it in the Ethernet 2.5 gigabit per second port back here. And then we'll plug in power. We're set to go. Just power it on. So it's finishing up the Windows setup, but I did want to mention Typically, you don't expect a lot of power out of a machine this size, but it's been flying through everything I've thrown at it. So I'm dying to see what it does like in gaming. And we'll be there in one sec. This is my Google Pixel 7 Pro. It's smaller than that. That's amazing. So I use my PC for a ton of things. One of the most important to me is gaming. Yeah, the Geekom A8X Pro can game. Let's check it out. Free for all. Weapons free. Online. 
see we're over 130 frames per second. Oh, <laughs> nice. <laughs> one shot, one kill. Oh, that was beautiful. No. Oh, no. Oh, okay. Nice. Why so eager to die when you could walk away? So aside from gaming, any machine I work on needs to be able to edit videos. So after I do the gaming and all that, I come back and then I write a script so that I can do a video like this. Open up Word and I start my script here. But if I need to use Excel for anything, I got that here too.
So this PC, you can use it for gaming, you can use it for editing, and you can use it for office applications, web browsing, no matter what you want to do with it, this system is incredibly fast. Again, it's not as powerful as, for example, a $4,000 system, but if you don't need it to do all that, this does it just fine. The Geekom AX8 Pro has everything you need inside of a little teeny tiny package. I'm incredibly surprised just how small it is and they can fit all of that right in there in that little package. So as it is, I'm actually incredibly impressed. I really didn't think I would like it. This is a machine I can see myself using. Again, maybe not for hardcore gaming, but if you just want to game around a little gaming, if you want to browse the web, if you want to work on office applications, maybe use it around the office. This is an awesome machine. I highly recommend the Geekom AX8 Pro machine. Don't forget to follow and subscribe to Geekom to stay up to date with the latest hardware that Geekom comes out with all the time. This is Iggy with This Bites for you up. See you guys.